Scott Walker in De Pere today signing HOPE agenda bills into law to fight against opiate abuse. HOPE, an acronym for Heroin Opiate Prevention and Education, is what Walker says is the forefront to battling what he calls an epidemic in the state right now. NBC 26's Regina Ahn joins us live at 5 with more. Regina. Megan, Governor Walker stopped in De Pere at the Medical College of Wisconsin to sign four out of a total of 11 HOPE bills. Walker making two other stops in Wisconsin to sign these bills in Schofield and Onalaska. The governor making all of these stops specifically to say we can't do it alone. He says it has to be a community effort to combat opioid addiction here in the state. The bills include measures that ensure someone who overdoses would be immune from probation or parole if the person goes into a treatment program, provides training to EMTs, first responders and law enforcement on how to administer Narcan, and supports communities to set up drug disposal programs. Well, we've got to deal with prevention, with treatment, with understanding, uh, with a combined effort so that even though the crisis knows no boundaries, the solution can know no boundaries as well. That truly for us to have hope, we have to act. And in turn, once we act, we can live a better and more prosperous life here in the state of Wisconsin. And so the hope agenda has been a mission for Republican Representative John Nygren of Marinette since 2013. Nygren's daughter struggled with heroin addiction and Walker is back from the National Governors Association last night. And he says this is a crisis among all the states with no boundaries on the opioid crisis. Keeping you connected, I'm Regina on NBC 26. Thank you, Regina.